Who's that man? You ever had an affair? No, I haven't had an affair. Is your wife? Mm. What's up, Jits? Um, I'm gonna move for some thriller. Obviously, y'all gonna move for some thriller. Let's watch some thriller. Let's go. This is uh, Last Scene Alive. I think this comes out June 3rd. You know, I have to ask you. How was your marriage? That's my guy. I think we need a break. What's the matter? I'm gonna have to pull over. And... <laughs> What's the matter? I'm gonna give y'all five seconds to tell me who she looked like. Hey man. They be putting this stuff right in our face, man. But we choose not to believe it. If you know, you know. What's the matter? I'm gonna have to pull over and almost on empty. Is it, it, is it the war it come in? I know I've not been around so much. I don't actually know what it is. So you don't know what's wrong. We know what happens when you're unfulfilled. We've been there. Ooh. I don't feel anything anymore. Looking for my wife. You didn't see a woman in here? I don't know. Lisa! 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 Here. She's with you. So they was in the gas station. He walked out, came back in, and she bounced. Weren't you supposed to drop her off here? One minute she was there, the next minute she was gone. Did you have a fight? Is that what this is? 911, what's your emergency? Uh, yeah, I would like to report a missing person, my wife. I need the camera footage from surveillance. Camera's been busted a couple weeks. You said the camera's not working. That's life. What's going on here? I got no video here, okay? Yeah. Hey, hey, stop! Okay, thank you! Very far. Who's that man? You ever had an affair? No, I haven't had an affair. Is your wife? You ever had an affair? Who's that man? You ever had an affair? No, I haven't had an affair. Is your wife? Where is she? Step out of the vehicle for a minute. <laughs> Do you mind popping the truck, please? Yeah, I'm a simple guy. I don't have any special skills. Zero what? That's who it is. No secret service. No special forces. But if someone harms my wife. Jamie Alexander. There'll be hell to be. Voltage pictures. They put out some pretty good stuff. Um I like that. I like the plot on it. Y'all tell me what y'all think about that plot. Um, I think that's a pretty solid plot. With things like with things like this, movies like this, it's like what was this? What can be disappointing is when like with plots like that that are so intricate, right? Every detail matters because it's like, yeah, like you're trying to solve what actually happened on your own before they reveal to you what actually happened right naturally um but you can only have the information to go off the only information you have to go off is what they reveal to you so yeah as, as 
the director, right? It's very important that the information is, is that, oh, I thought that said Brad Pitt, Brian Pitt, I'm probably his brother or something, I don't know. But like I was saying, it's very important that the information that you reveal to the audience is consistent um, and cohesive, right? Because once we start having to assume too much um, because they're simply not telling us important parts of the story, that becomes frustrating. That becomes very frustrating. It's like, okay, well, how the heck does he know this? How did he know this? Well, what happened this? Boom, boom. How did they get this evidence? How did they, where did this person come into the picture? Who is that? Why is he doing this? Because as the director, you failed to share certain information with us and because you're trying to push the story along. Um, so with that being said, again, like I think it's a great plot. Obviously it has great actors in it. Jamie Alexander, <laughs> Gerard Butler, he's a really good actor. Um, but yeah, hopefully they just maintain consistency. Uh, Cause I like, I like, I like to solve, um, I like to do some solving on my own when I'm watching movies and assume certain things and create the story in my head before I have the whole story. Because at the end, you get to figure out whether you were right or you were wrong. You get to, you know, you get to, it's like you're there with them. So that's a pretty good plot. It's a solid plot. I'll give this movie at a 10. I'll give it a solid six based on the trailer. Based on the trailer, well, I'll give it a solid six. And that's, pre that's pretty good, that's pretty high. I'd say that's a success, it's definitely above average. So uh, let me know what you guys think. Um, if you'd watch this movie, it comes out June 3rd. And uh, yeah, I will see y'all in the next one. Peace.